walks along Crystal Lake in Robbinsdale this weekend had to take a detour. The last couple of walks, within the last couple of weeks, we've noticed that the water levels are, are fairly high for this time of year. So, wow. I had to go around. I wasn't going through it, so I went around there. The boat launch is closed as the lake creeps into the lot. When it floods, it might just come barely over the banks back there. I've never seen it come across this lot like this, so it must have rained a lot. On Fish Lake in Maple Grove, no wake signs are up because of the high water. In the shorelines, there really is not, nothing showing at all. There aren't any rocks or anything like that. It's pretty much under underwater. The water's also up on the St. Croix River near Stillwater. The DNR lists levels there as being very high. And on Lake Minnetonka, the Conservation District says levels aren't up enough to declare high water, but they still want people to take it slow to prevent the wake from eroding the shoreline. Back along Crystal Lake. Well, I've lived around here 39 years and I've never seen it that high. The high water isn't necessarily putting a damper on weekend plans, just causing them to take a turn. Yeah, that ain't so bad. You just go around them, that's all. And in Stearns County, the sheriff's office says they have high water levels on every lake and river in the county. They have no wake restrictions in place there. Jennifer Austin, CARE 11 News.